President Trump is hot under the collar following General Motors' decision to cut jobs and close factories here in the U.S. Now the president is threatening serious repercussions. Fox Business correspondent Susan Lee has the story. There's a lot of disappointment, even anger. Frustration that was expressed even more clearly in the middle of the White House press briefing. President Trump tweeting, very disappointed with General Motors and their CEO, Mary Barra, for closing plants in Ohio, Michigan, and Maryland. Nothing being closed in Mexico and China. The U.S. saved General Motors, and this is the thanks that we get. We are now looking at cutting all GM subsidies, including for electric cars. General Motors made a big China bet years ago when they built plants there and in Mexico. Don't think that bet is going to pay off. I am here to protect America's workers. Buyers of GM-made electric cars get $7,500 back in tax credits, a subsidy that goes away after 200,000 are sold, a provision that General Motors has lobbied to extend. As for moving production outside of the U.S., the automaker fired back, saying GM is committed to maintaining a strong manufacturing presence in the U.S., adding that many of the U.S. workers impacted by these actions will have the opportunity to shift to other GM plants. General Motors announced plans to cut over 14,000 jobs in North America and shut factories in three U.S. states, including in Ohio, jobs that President Trump had vowed to keep on the campaign campaign trail. Well, well.